What is going on you beautiful human being? Welcome back to my channel. Today we're reacting to Jujutsu Kaisen episode 17. This is going to be crazy. The ending of last episode was absolutely out of this world. If you like Jujutsu Kaisen, smash that like button. Consider subscribing to my anime reaction videos and hit that notification bell obviously because you want to stay up to date, right? Let's go. Yuji. Oh, remember the blue means that it's a throwback. Oh, his grandfather. Wow, it's crazy how long ago that's been, right? When his, like, grandfather was still in the hospital. Thunderclap part two. I don't know what's happening here because everybody got mauled. Only two demon dogs are granted to the user at first. So this is Muga Magumi. All ten Shikigami. But remember, oh, so he got away remember there was that big guy and he was asking megumi for help he's like wake up you stupid sorcerer there's all that oh so this is where he collapses because remember there was this big like beast like you just saw his feet but Even if it's pointless, there are still ways. Well, there are ways to use it. There's never been one who managed to subjugate this one. Since the Edo era or the Kecha era. Oh my goodness, they both died. Oh wow. The Ten Shadows technique and the Limitless technique. They killed each other. <laughs> oh my gosh. Magumi, I mean, look at his father as well. Sacred treasure, swing and ring, ring. Even Sakuna checked it. Uraume, that's who it was. Who randomly came out of nowhere. Holy shit, Megumi, what is this about? He was explaining something about the techniques, but I couldn't keep up to it at all. Eight Grip Sword. Divergent Sila Divine General. Mahorgara. Oh my gosh, is this his like most strongest Shikagami? Wait. So it was Megumi who summoned this thing. I'll be dying first. Dude, he looks like Gojo. Oh my gosh. He's dead. The technique of the curse user, Haruto. One miracle is released when he faces a threat. Sakuna. Whoa. Whoa, this is getting insane. I'll have to defeat the Shikagami as an outsider. Time for a tasting. Oh my gosh. 
Wild, wild show, wild show. I'm barely keeping up here. It's been a long week and it's only Tuesday, but let's go. This is insane. Sakuna versus the Shikigami. So basically, if that guy dies, then Megumi will die with him because that means the ritual is complete. Holy dismantle. <laughs> the dude's just casually drinking cool drink. It's a sort of extermination. Wow. What? The fact that this thing is so strong that even Sakuna has to move is crazy wow just sliced his leg but can it regenerate doesn't look like it this thing is so strong that's so weird kind of looks like Mewtwo mixed with Majin Buu <laughs> on one leg it grabbed that car like it was a piece of blanket it's crazy to see that this thing is giving Sukuna more trouble than Jogo oh he split his head what he, he saved his head Bro, the city is gone. Was I not saying in the last episode, like... Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. The thing is, even if they win, like, how long will it take to bring the city back? Now that felt odd. What is this? Oh. I mean, the level of this thing is so strong that the fact that it's doing this with Sakuna and everybody else couldn't even, like, Oh, is he limited by the string or something? Or is that wires? Oh my gosh. Then, like, that's the thing. It's not like in other shows where someone is going to be there to, like, save the people. It's like they're going to be killed. Oh my god, it's like they're changing reality itself. And this is what Megumi has oh my gosh <laughs> this is so crazy this is so crazy wow you can see, see my technique What is his technique? The Shogo was saying he thought it was like sever and slice, but then he could use like the flame as well. It's it's like a cataclysm on the city. Like this place is completely wiped out. A meteor? Oh, a plane! Oh my goodness. Wow, this animation is... This episode is... I, I have no words for this episode. Oh, the electricity. Wow. 
bro oh my gosh that's I, I don't know how many times i'm gonna say it but the city is done so i think it's that thing on the head that keeps regenerating you're similar to yamato no orochi you follow my slices and attack with cursed energy the incantation of sacred treasures is to adapt to anything and everything oh my gosh you might have beat me Makumi Fushiguru Domain Expansion Malevolent Shrine Oh my gosh Wow 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 So it goes everywhere Two hundred meter radius. Oh, because he does want to kill Megumi. Oh, one shot. These people are yeah. And they were just having the Halloween party. That's what's crazy. Cleave attacks. Dismantle. Oh my gosh, all those people are gone. Bro, he is... Oh, he's gonna take the whole city. Oh wait, but they said 140 meters because of Megumi. Mahoraga. Wow. I have goosebumps, bro. Sakuna is something else. Bro, look at him. Fuga. Oh my. Wait, what? It's a Dory. What happened? What the hell just happened, bro? Oh, it's not. He can Oh, so he still can't kill him. Shigemonosakuaita <laughs> Bro, you need Goja. I've been saying this for like four episodes. Be sure to savor this. What is he like letting him see? Oh my gosh. Oh, he's showing him all the memories. Oh my god. Oh my gosh, bro. But why are they playing the, the opening song? I saw there is more episodes, so I don't understand. They, like, this is normally what happens, like, at an end of a season. Oh my gosh, dude. This is what happens when Sukuna comes out, bro. Bro, I have to go. I have to fight. Otherwise, I'll just be... A murderer.
Wait, the episode is still going. Oh my word, Nanami. I thought he was dead. Oh my word, he's completely burnt. Oh my gosh, half of his face. Oh, bro. I know I say this all the time, but I think Jujutsu Kaisen might be the greatest anime of all time. <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't, you know, it's almost like I feel like a normal person would like push pause and just sit and try take it all in and not just sit here and fumble because that's probably what i'm gonna do now i don't even know where to start sukuna is a monster first of all i mean i honestly thought it was still moving to like you know all the like the big moments were finished you know with the whole meteor attack on the city after him killing jogo then we see that megumi and this is why he's like he's actually on this different level i can't even remember what it was called but it was like the 10 something technique they flash back to him and gojo talking and they said that the reason why they have sort of this bad blood is because they're always clashing but what happened was the head of gojo clan and the head of the zenin clan i don't know what he mentioned it in a way that seemed like it was kind of like like an exhibition match I, i'm not sure if i read that correctly but it seemed like it wasn't like a a serious fight but they got carried away and that guy the head of the gojo clan he was also cursed with um the six eyes the limitless technique and the zenon clan leader had the technique of that megumi just showed now and they ended up killing each other so that's why megumi was like well are you telling me that like i can kill you right so that's what's crazy now it's like megumi now it's pushed him into this whole new stratosphere of how powerful he can be and then releasing that shikagami like what is that it's kind of like in you see in pokemon there's this move by i think it's by gengar it's one of the ghosts where like they basically take you with them on the last strike so if you kill them if your pokemon kills that pokemon who's used that technique it'll take them with him i can't remember what it is what it's called now but it's very similar to that so he was they were explaining a lot and like it just went right past Asked me but basically he attached himself to that guy the guy with the blonde i forgot what his name was so when he dies then megumi will die as well and unless i think it's unless he kills the cursed spirit so that's why sakuna went and saved that guy because you know he didn't want he, he wants to use megumi and then he that fight against i forgot his name now it's haruraga or something like that amazing he almost had like that that wheel on his head that that they normally depict like gods to have in anime you know with the circles and the ring very intense i mean you saw it with naruto and you saw it in uh dragon ball super with uh, goku black and zamazu they've got that they always have that ring so he had that very similar ring who <sighs> it's it, just intense man and what a fight the whole city just got wiped out and we saw his domain expansion malevolent shrine my gosh that doesn't need a barrier <laughs> <laughs> it's just i think i there was something that i missed but it can go up to like a 200 meter radius or depending on something else that's how far it can go i think it's got to do with the person that he's facing but he obviously kept it to 140 because he didn't want to kill megumi but it just has endless dismantles and endless slices and just destroys everything in its in its radius but oh my gosh like i said this is most likely the greatest anime of all time like it's very hard to even think about anything that comes close to it but oh, i'm amped for the next episode but that's gonna be it for me man if you like jujitsu guys and hit that like button consider subscribing to my anime reaction video so that you can keep up to date with this because this is insane that's gonna be it for me thanks for watching if you're watching i'm gonna leave the last episode right up over here i'm out peace in a bit.